Hey, it's Thomas Clark 11 with another Aura's Wi-Fi battle. Again, using my new Gorgeist, Camilla. And pretty standard team on the opponent's side, I guess. Not much I can think about to say about it. So a knockoff is very, very obvious there. Don't want to keep Awesome in just to get O code. And even if the item couldn't be knocked off, that was still a lot of damage. That flinch mattered. Flinch definitely mattered because then I remember this thing is obviously no guard with Stone Edge. But since it did that much damage before Mega, after Mega Evolution, I would have enough special attack that another Air Slash would definitely take it out. So Tyrone cars are always Luckily, I got off Reflect before I lost the Light Clay. And can't Toxic this thing, so might as well paralyze it. I was gonna switch out anyway, but that ruined the element of surprise of switching. Though there was a possibility that I could have had to play, but still. So it took me a really long time to decide on that because I didn't know if they were going to switch to Tyranitar like it seemed they would. Now they either have to fodder this off or switch it. More likely they're just going to fodder it off though. Okay, now it's too big to do much. Oh, they did switch. Right, so I knew Tyranitar was coming, and this Focus Blast would have killed the Suicune anyway, so... Now, what really shocked me is that in the sand, Tyranitar didn't live. I was really surprised by that. It had to have been a purely offensive mega event. They go for sweet powder or toxic. Wasn't expecting a sword to that set. So now I'm just hoping that they'll get greedy and go for something. Go for more swords dance. But I didn't even know that Venusaur could learn knockoff.
now with Tyranitar gone, this thing is not safe at all. I have no idea why they would go for a knockoff when I'm Mega. Either it was a misclick, or they thought- No, why would they think I would switch? It had to have been a misclick. So, this was actually baiting me into thinking that it was a Scarf Typhlosion. It was really a... I'm not sure... maybe Specs? I forgot what the item was, but it was definitely not Scarf. Ah, Life Orb. It was Life Orb. So they made me think that they were a Scarf Typhlosion, and I completely wasted Yui because of that. Lissa mix misses the toxic. Of course. But that was enough to scare them out, so... I was kind of sacking Eren at this point, but got lucky and they were paralyzed anyway. And for that, I am just so sorry. But if it makes you feel any better, my Typhlosion easily could have taken out your Drifion. Yes, yeah, so now I know that I can have speed this thing, or at least speed tie with it, and I lost the speed tie. But I know that my Typhlosion can have speed it. If anyone's ever wondered, my Typhlosion is the only non-nicknamed Pokemon I have just because when I got a Cyndaquil and Heart Gold, and Typhlosion ended up becoming my favorite Pokemon, I never had a name on it, so Typhlosion just seems more sentimental to me. Right, and right there, they forfeited. I was kind of taking a big risk going for Eruption on their Typhlosion, but because of the way that they kept it in, I mean, because of, well, basically just the way they were switching it out and in, made me believe that it was not flash fire as it turned out to just be blaze so if you want to battle me then take the twitter link in the description below and tweet me asking for a battle so see you next time